hey guys welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be yet another tutorial using the chocolate bar palette I'm sorry I'm obsessed with this palette and I just needed to use this palette again so here I'm priming the face using the Laura Mercier primer in radiance and here I'm just concealing the dark spots on my face so I'm using the Max Pro Longwear Concealer in NW35 and using a damp beauty blender to blend that out Now here I'm going in with my Beauty Balm today. I'll be using the Too Faced Beauty Balm and I'm in the shade Beach Glow. I'm just placing it all over the face and blending it out with the damp beauty blender. Now here I'm doing a cream contour using the Maybelline Fit Me Stick. I'm not sure what the shade is, I'll link that below. So I'm just placing this where I would normally contour the face and I'm using the Beauty Blender to blend that out again. Now here I'm just setting the concealer and the powder I'm using today is from Graftobia. This is in the shade Banana Cream Pie. So wherever I placed the concealer earlier, I'm setting that. And now I'm using a bronzer to pretty much set the cream um, foundation stick that I just used. So it's almost like I'm setting it and putting color back into my face. And the bronzer is by Sephora. Now here onto the eyes, so I'm using the NYX's uh, shadow base, this one is in skin tone. And jumping into the palette, oh my gosh, I'm going in with the shade Candid Violet. That is the purple shade in the chocolate bar palette. So I'm just placing that all over the lid and staying under the crease, you don't want to go above the crease. Now here just to get the edge a little sharp. I'll be using a bit of tape and now I'm going in with the shade Cherry Cordial so I'm just pretty much as you can see there I'm making a wing with the shadow and then bringing it up into the crease sorry I was in, not in focus I don't know what was going on with my camera but you guys see what I'm doing you get the drift Then I'm going in with a clean blending brush with the shade Semi Sweet and just blend those edges out a bit. To highlight the brows, I'm using white chocolate, just placing that under the brow bones. Under the brow, sorry. Just blend that. And now I'm going back in with the same blending brush and using 
make a geek scramble brulee and just blend a little bit more. Now here for my wing liner today I'm using my Inglot gel liner in number 77 black. Just making a wing. And I'm wearing and the pulses that I'm wearing today are by Ardell. And these are the 113 lashes. And here I'm just pinching my natural lashes and the false lashes together just so that it look like one. Just making sure that it's set correctly. Now here I'm going in with a Makeup Geeks pigment and this one is in the shade Enchanted. Just placing that over the lid. And now I'm going to do my bottom lashes. Don't forget that and I'm using uh, Too Faced Lash Gasm Mascara and here I'm applying my blush and I'm using the shade Iris by Makeup Geek not by Makeup Geek, by BH Cosmetics, sorry and as my highlight today I'm using MAC Soft and Gentle so I'm placing on the higher points of the cheeks above the lip and the chin, above the forehead and on the bridge of the nose and just using a clean brush and blending everything out. And as my lipstick choice today, I wanted to keep it in the purple family, so I went ahead and used Lime Crime's um, Airborne Unicorn Lipstick. And I really love this color. When you finish, you want to set the face. I'm using Max Fix Plus, and that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoy this yet another um, chocolate bar tutorial. I know I have a couple up, so I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And I just want to say hi to all my subscribers. Hope you guys are doing well. And until my next video, I will see you guys later. Bye!